Oh, it's not a three. It's a monster of a fish. Good fish right there. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jeremy. This is Fish and Lone Star. Today we are doing a total unboxing of the Monster Bass Regional Pro box or bag. And uh, if you couldn't already tell by the thumbnail, it is featuring all Z-Man baits and products. That's right, nothing but Z-Man and a takeover. So I'm gonna break down each of these. A lot of these are meant to be fished together, but it doesn't mean you have to. You can fish them however you would like. So I'm gonna give you some options. We're gonna talk about it just a little bit and uh, show you what all came in this awesome box, the Z-Man Takeover by Monster Bass. So let's dig in. Now, as I show you some of these, you're gonna tell that I've already have them paired up, but I'll talk about them as we go because you can definitely pair them differently than what I have here. So first and foremost, this is the Cross Eyes Chatterbait. All right, what's unique about this particular Chatterbait is has a, a little weed guard right here. And I will say it's pretty stiff, right? That's a pretty stiff weed guard. And it's meant to be fished around a little bit of the heavier stuff. So maybe some heavier timber, things like that. Or even if you're fishing from the bank and you uh, don't want to lose your chatterbait, it's a great chatterbait to tie on that cross size. Now I have it paired here with the razor sheds. I'll talk about that particular soft plastic in a minute. You can pair it with whatever you would like to. Uh, there's a couple other options uh, in the bag, but this is the fire crawl razor sheds that I have tied on here. It makes for a great little chatterbait trailer and uh, an awesome color right now as we're going into spring. All right, another chatterbait here. This one's pretty unique. This is the Chatterbait Freedom CFL. It's got this unique big football head and it's meant to be fished slow and low and around a bunch of rocks uh, kind of like a day like today it's 47 degree water temps uh, high sun so fish are probably going to be hugging low uh, the barometric pressure is relatively high this is probably going to be a lure that i'm going to tie on and kind of drag around a lot of those rocks make some commotion make some vibration and uh, it's paired there with the goat and some uh, some heavy kicking legs you can see those legs or feet right there are going to kick and create a lot of motion. Uh, again, I'll come back to that soft plastic in just a second. Staying in the chatterbait category, we also have the Willow Vibe, all right? Uh, another great little, I would say this is more like a finesse chatterbait, but you've got that little Willow Blade right there in the front, but don't let this bait fool you. This little Willow Vibe, uh, little, little finesse chatterbait, has a lot of vibration. I've done previous videos on it. Uh, I'm pretty pumped this one came in the box, but that little Willow Vibe, Man, it, 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 when I say it vibes, it literally will shake your rod tip. It vibrates so much. Uh, that's paired up with the deal color and the minnows, but uh, you can throw on kind of any, any type of finesse soft plastic you want on the back, a little paddle tail, but that's a great little option. Again, we'll come back to the plastic in just a moment. Sticking in the kind of the jig head category, we had the swim bait eye. All right, this is an awesome uh, little little jig head by Z-Man. I say little, this is a, a one fourth ounce, I believe. Yeah, so this is a quarter ounce. It's got this big eye, which gives bass a big key to target in on. Now, you can pair that, uh, again, with the minnows here. You can pair it with whatever swim bait you would like to, but that's an awesome uh, little jig head that Z-Man has brought you and Monster Bass has thrown in this particular month's takeover. All right, let's talk about the plastics now. This is the goat, all right? This is a green pumpkin, um, uh, little plastic here by Z-Man. And what's really unique about this is, well, first of all, Z-Man plastic is super, super stretchy. That's the elastic. But these little legs are gonna kick really well. The cool thing is you can Texas rig this, you can throw it as a jig trailer, you can put it as a trailer as a chatterbait, you can put it as a trailer as a swim jig. There's a ton of options here. You can throw it on like a football, um, a uh, wobble head, you can throw it on a shaky head. I'm telling you guys, this little plastic is going to catch a lot of fish. This is a green pumpkin color, pretty universal and pretty awesome that they included this one in this month's box. All right, we talked about the minnows on the back of that willow vibe, but here it is just a soft plastic paddle tail by itself. Again, super stretchy, uh, but this is an awesome little paddle tail swim bait, and I really like 
this color too, the deal. That's an awesome color. It's got a little bit of flake on top, a little translucent, tr <laughs> translucent bottom, but uh, an awesome little finesse uh, paddle tail swim bait. Uh, I really like these. I've thrown these in the past and uh, they work really well. Um, pretty pumped about this one. You can pair it with um, this particular swim bait eye. You can pair it with a willow vibe, or if you have anything else that you want to pair it with at home, certainly throw it on there. It's going to work really well. All right, two more to show you. This is the Razor Shads, and this is that fire crawl color. And uh, this is gonna be fantastic for spring. You can see as I move it, how the sun is just reflecting off of that. It is an awesome color. It's gonna do extremely, extremely well in the springtime uh, or in those cooler months. Uh, but I love this particular uh, uh, trailer. This works really well as a trailer on a spinner bait. Works really well as a trailer on a chatter bait. Uh, I haven't really thrown it by itself, although it would have probably some subtle action. The majority of the action though is going to come as a trailer on the back of a chatterbait. You can throw it however you like though. That's just my recommendation is on the back of a chatterbait. Alright, and then the last one here. I don't drop shot a lot, but I can, I can tell you that this is going to make for a great little drop shot finesse presentation. Alright, this is the finesse shads in a pearl color. Uh, it's an awesome little finesse style soft plastic and what I really love about this particular uh, box that Monster Bass brought you is not only is it packed full of some amazing baits by Z-Man but it also has a ton of different types of presentations so for example you can throw a bladed jig you could throw a bladed jig on bottom you could throw a vibrating jig that's a little bit more finesse you can throw a swim bait eye uh, or you could even throw a drop shot with one of these you could throw this on a Texas rig just tons of different choices here, all by Z-Man. But one thing I will tell you though before I wrap up this video, when it comes to any of your Z-Man plastics, do not, I repeat, do not store these with any other plastics. In fact, they come in clamshell packaging as you see here. I would highly recommend you store all of them in this packaging. Trust me on that. This plastic will not play well with your other plastics. It'll melt, merge all together, and you gotta throw it all away. So. Take your plastics, keep them in these clamshells, get you a little binder or something like that to keep them all in, Ziploc bag, etc. Or one of your monster bass bags, keep them all in there, keep them separated from each other. All right, guys, that's a wrap. I'm going to take uh, some of these here. I'm not really sure which one, but I'm going to take one of these bladed jigs. I'm on Lake Louisville today. I'm going to tie one of them on and get to work, hopefully catch some fish. You can check that out on another video, though, because this is just about this particular Monster Bass Z-Man takeover unboxing. Drop me a comment below. Me. Let me know what your favorite bait was, because there's some pretty awesome ones in this particular box. Make sure you also hit the link below. If you're not subscribed to the Monster Bass Regional Pro Bag, you need to be because there's some amazing baits every single month that get you out of your comfort zone. Try something new, try something different. And quite honestly, just be a better angler and learn to fish better. That's what Monster Bass is all about. If you've not subscribed right here, we'd love for you to stick around and see more videos here on Fishing Lone Star. My name is Jeremy. If nobody told Jake, I love you. And so do I. Peace out.